you know it's a long weekend in the gym when you're downstairs and there's nobody here the weights are racked perfectly you've got the entire floor to yourself yes that's what i'm talking about yes hey good morning it's monday morning i just arrived back at res my dad and i drove through this morning to pretoria yeah got a um, microchips class test today had about up us 11, so just busy studying for that. And I have that ELI linear system circuits pack due tonight, just proving the Fourier series and that. I've been using a program called Latex. It's taken me ages to finish it, and my wrists are sore from typing, but it's nearly done. Um, here's a look at the finished product, by the way. And yeah, it's going to be a good day, going to be a good week. Edge week is next week, so this is the last week of lectures before that. So just going to be studying this week. Anyway, I'll see you at lectures. I'm on my way to campus. I absolutely have to do laundry tonight. I'm going to have no clean socks tomorrow. It was uh, nearly quite an emergency this morning. Can't lie. My way, are you okay? Not really. We found something beautiful. Our linear systems prac is due today. So everyone's busy working on it. We're going to finish it. Boys, 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 boys. How was the knee? Oh, how was the knee? <laughs> How's the legs, Todd? Yeah, I don't think it could fit in the video. It was like an hour documentary. Review <laughs> video. How was the test, boykies? <laughs> Even the easy questions are misread. So, yeah. Five minutes to go, I'm like, oh shit, we gotta fill in a spreadsheet. <laughs> oh. Microchips test. I'm back with Stefan and Mika in the study center. We are busy working on our ELI prep. Mika's doing some maths. I'm doing some code. I don't know what Stefan's doing. I'm doing some maths. <laughs> um, this is due at midnight tonight. Quite tired. I'm sick of latex. It's not the kind of latex I'd like to be using, but alas, here we are. Coach of the week. I know, right? Jeez, that has to be the coach. Oh, by the way, I made this meme and I've sent it to the Varsity meme page. I'm wondering if they're going to post it today. I really hope so. Use the wrong yeah. Too much latex. And now heaven's oceans full. Sweet love, I never thought I'd feel. But it's okay, go your own way. Somebody please hold my hand, hand. I know I should make a stand, stand. I yes, Ryan, how's the maths? What is like? The most complicated thing I've ever like, seen in my life. Oh yes, hectic. This is Dr. Palinkut behind me. He's a legend of a lecturer. Whew. I understand most of that. Do you understand it, boy? Uh, I think I do. Ah, you think you do. The semester yeah, test like, is coming. I had a bit of prior knowledge that Afrikaans group told me it was a convolution. So I was like waiting for it. It's like, wait for it. it. It rings a bell somewhere from some maths I never learned properly. There is massive amounts of graft being done in this kitchen. Everyone is working on the ERR test. Very impressed. So much graft. I'm so impressed. Jared, how are you enjoying the circuit's life? Um, love it. Pavan also looks like he is having fun with it. I hate this module so much. <laughs> All these chemical engineers enjoying our circuits modules. I have uh, finished my latex mo uh, assignment for the for my report. It's done. I was waiting to read my other friends to read through it, and then we're going to submit. It's been days in the making, and my eyes feel like they really are square. But it's so nice to be done. I can't wait for that rice to be done either. I'm starving. Yeah. Good lord, I haven't done washing in about nearly three weeks now because I've got enough clean 
pants and underwear and that to like last me three weeks without washing. But good lord, I would not recommend it. It's kind of a genetic experiment been happening down in the bottom of this cupboard. Fuck my life. Um, it's 12 o'clock now, which obviously means it's the perfect time to go do laundry. Um, oh, my eyes are sore from working on that um, draft report, but it's done, it's finished, submitted, looks good. And um, yeah, I'm just busy editing a video and I'm going to go put this laundry in. Because being an adult is hard sometimes. <laughs> Sitting out here with the boys, enjoying the sun, pretending to do some maths, 263. <laughs> uh, yeah. How's your day been? It's been alright. Started nice and late, so that was good. It is. Oh, I went to bed at 3, and so I woke up at half past 8. It was beautiful. My lecture was like boring and not very helpful. But now we have a break, which is super nice. Yeah, I don't know what's happening in stats. Got a quick hour and a half break in between maths huts now, so sneaking off to the gym to train some arms quickly. Gotta love varsity life. Enjoying that freedom while we still have it. Whew. We are walking up to our last lecture of the day, digital systems. We've done nothing today. We've done fuck all today. And look, it's my bike. Hey. Uh, both of the math stats were just fun times. It was just a good day. Ryan and I are walking out of ERS. How are you feeling? Okay. I'm a bit tired. They've landed a lot of projects on us, so things are getting intense. Last lecture of the day, ELI, linear systems. Everyone is damn tired. And yeah, not a lot has been going on today except work. How are you doing, Mika? Tired, yeah. getting ready for entry. That's it. Sort of all over the place, but yeah. And it's a certain someone, Stefan's birthday on Friday. And there's a lot of jawling plans, but look, just before entry. It's oh. fine, you've got a whole two days to recover. Whole two days. <gasps> Good morning, it's Thursday morning today. I'm a little bit late for stats, so I'm busy rushing, but I'm. Um, I only realize now, but it kind of looks like the Cold War is fighting its way across my body this morning. America on the socks, Russia on the shirt. Gotta love that metaphorical clothing. Anyway, see you on the road. I woke up in the middle of the night last night, and there was quite a wind howling. Now the wind is gone this morning, but it's cold. The last vestiges of winter clawing their way at the city. Anyway, it's lovely to be outside, breathing in the fresh air. For a day inside with lectures. <sighs> Sweet love, I never thought I'd feel, but it's okay. Go your own way. Somebody, please hold my hand, hand. I know I should make a stand, stand. I'm here with Mika and Stefan in the study center. We're about to start our ERS practical. And look who's next door. Manny. <laughs> We're making progress. Um, Stevie and Johan had half the circuit working, then we pulled it all out because we thought we were wrong, but we weren't. But right now, switch two and switch four should be switching the LED on when it's connected. <laughs> Can you imagine? S2 and S4, boom, the LED comes on. Excellent. According to Johan's excellent um, schematic here. Well done, bro. The prac is coming together. Excellent. Johan, can you explain to my audience here what's actually happening? <laughs> Not exactly. <laughs> you want to give it a shot, Mika? Um, well, how much does your audience know about? Nothing. Uh, nothing. Okay, so, oh, my word. Okay, basically, um, we're passing along a bunch of uh, signals and the signals are either a yes or a no 
And so, yeah, we're generating the input off the FPGA board. That's just powering the whole circuit. That's giving us stuff to, to work with. And then basically, all these components here give us different combinations of yes and no's. And so we've got to decide, um, we're lighting up this LED here based on different combinations of input through different things. So, yeah, there's, there's quite a few inputs that we've, that we've rooted out. And then we've got... Um, oh, you can see them all. Yeah, we've got 12 different inputs. So depending on the combinations of those 12, well, we've got four inputs which come to 12 outputs, and those outputs then become more things. So yeah, that's basically, yeah it's, it's a bunch of, we're making decisions electronically. Okay. And this is for our microchip subject, and we're basically actually building the logic of our cars that have to run next year.